A Shelby County woman called Fish and Wildlife to tell them she did not want her snake anymore. What she did not tell them, <laughs> it's one of the most venomous snakes in the world, a five foot long monocled cobra. LEX 18's Jacqueline Nye reports in the big story at six. The woman told Fish and Wildlife she didn't want the snake anymore because it had just become too big. Fish and Wildlife also say she told the conservation officer that she did not want him to tell police she had the snake. It is entirely possible that it was born in captivity here in the United States or potentially even in like Europe or something and imported into the U.S. It's also possible that it was a wild snake that was imported at some point. The conservation officer then arranged a meeting with the woman to remove the snake. The cobra was then taken to the Kentucky Reptile Zoo. These guys are native to Southeast Asia, so Thailand, Malaysia, that area of, of the world. And uh, this particular species is actually very easy to maintain and breed in captivity. The monoclad cobra's venom is one of the fastest acting snake venoms in the world. The venom could cause death within an hour of envenomation. If this snake can cause tissue damage and it, it can actually cause some clotting problems as well, but in addition, it can have a neurotoxin in its venom that can cause you to be paralyzed or have respiratory problems. The snake's owner was charged with importing and holding prohibited dangerous wildlife. Covering the news in Powell County from the LEX 18 Mobile Newsroom, back to you. <laughs>